All right, some breaking news coming in on the broadcast. Uh, there has been a suspicious object that has been destroyed by the BDS of the police in Baramula. The suspicious object was found at a flyover in Baramula district. Breaking developments coming in from Baramula. All right, that is the... Uh, visuals coming in where a suspicious object was destroyed by uh, the bomb disposal squad of the police in Baramula. Uh, my colleague Pradeep is joining us to give us details. Pradeep, what exactly was the item, the suspicious object that was destroyed by uh, the bomb disposal squad of the police in Baramula? A big uh, uh, success for the security forces that they were able to detect the uh, suspected improvised explosive device that was planted near uh, pattern on the Paramula Road. And it was uh, today morning that the road opening party, and, uh, during their patrolling, they were able to detect this improvised explosive device. Immediately after that area was cornered, nobody was allowed to cross from that side. That means that terrorists have planted this uh, explosive material to target either security forces or the civilian vehicle passing by, because it's normally a route is used both by the security forces as well as the civilian uh, uh, so to, to move from one place to another place. And when this area was cordoned, when this uh, properly it was detected, and after that the bomb disposal squad was called. And bomb disposal squad, as you can see in the visual, that they finally were able to neutralize. They carried out uh, an explosion in which this explosive material was destroyed. And you can see that how big explosion had been there. So you can very well understand, had this explosive device exploded, it would have definitely led to a lot of casualties. Because now these terrorists, they know that they can't go for direct confrontation with the security forces. They are either going for shoot or scoot attack, either they are going for the targeted killing, or they will try to plant and provide explosive device because that way uh, their casualty will be uh, less. So they are trying to avoid direct confrontation. So they are adopting uh, these uh, new tactics which they have been doing for the last three decades, either planting IED or going, lobbing a grenade or even going for the targeted killing. But yes, a major tragedy has been averted by security forces that they were able to timely detect this explosive material that was planted on the Barabla Road near Patan area. And uh, that was finally, uh, the area was cordoned and they were able to call the boundaries from the squad. And now you can see uh, that uh, they, they have uh, destroyed this object and uh, there had been a big explosion. So now the road has been opened. And uh, now the traffic movement has once again been restored because it had come to the skating hall because nobody was allowed to cross from that side. That really shows that how these terrorists uh, uh, they they are trying to inflict maximum casualty. They are least concerned about the civilians. They are least concerned about Kashmiris. So they can't be well wishes of any right. of them. That Pakistan cannot see with a smile on right. their faces. And that's one of the reasons that they are opting for these attacks. Right, Pradeep, appreciate you joining us and giving us all the details on that story.